Welcome to Comcast High School Sports On Demand, powered by MaxPreps.com. I'm Cynthia Nickerson. This will be one of the most memorable moments in Randy Bassard's life. Winning the girls' 5A basketball state championship. Randy played hard, even though she was sick that day. She wanted to end her senior year on a high note, and that determination to win has been her trademark from an early age, even though basketball originally was not Randy's first choice for a sport. Basketball just never really registered for me. I just kind of like fooled around with it just for fun, and I seen all my cousins playing, so I just joined in, and um, I really started loving basketball when I first tried out for Fort Bend Stars, so my first AA team, and my first love was really tennis. Like, I really loved tennis, and I thought I was gonna go somewhere with that, and then I started getting taller, and just things just started going the opposite way, so I was like, you know, let me try basketball, and it's kind of been in my blood ever since. Her dad realized her gift during those early AAU tryouts. Okay, I'll tell you what, I'll make you a deal. I told her, I said, I'll spend every dollar in my pocket. Long as you don't make me pay for college, I'll give you all the tools you need. And she said, it's a deal. I said, when we go in here, this is going to determine whether it's gonna, this is going to be a deal or not. And when she went in there, man, she breezed through all the skills and all the training like it was nothing. I said, I think I got something. I think I got something special here. Due to Ramsey's athleticism, she is a versatile player. All the handling the ball because she had to do everything. But when she got into you know high school, they put her down in the post. And it's like some of that kind of went away. It was Actually, she suppressed it because she had a, another role. And it was to play with her back to the basket. So when we went back to AAU, that's when they was like, nah, we, we, let's, let's get her ready for a true position. You know what I'm saying? True position is going to be, you know, for a wing, you know what I'm saying? But she's going to have the ability to go down here and bang with the best. Indeed, she is playing with the best. Randy arrived at Manville during her sophomore year and was happy to join a team with talented players such as Brianna Turner and Jordan Hosey. Um, when I saw the team, I was um, very happy. I knew it was going to be a lot of talent, and I knew it was going to get far one day. Uh, last year, you know, I thought it was us all the way. We fell short in the third round, but this year we came back and had something to prove, and we went all the way to state and won. And last year's loss gave Randy more determination than ever. She spent last summer working out and making sure she was the absolute best she could be. I just wanted to train my body down, get in a better shape for this year, and work hard and I ran and I did fundamental drills, went to work out with a trainer, ran the hills, I did everything I could and I just felt that it was best for my body. I owed it to myself to be the best player this year, one of the best players this year and uh, to help my team out and get up and down the court more faster and to uh, just, you know, not be a trailer so much but also be the leading person. So I just wanted to be a great leader and by that I had to get myself in shape and do what it took to be a phenomenal athlete. Uh, but but Randy is one of those kids that has just you know a great foundation, you know, great family upbringing, uh, very respectful. Yes sir, no sir. Uh, you know, she actually comes to you and, and gives ideas, which some people are a little intimidated to do. Um, uh, you know, her her character is is really good. She's she has no enemies. She's I mean her personality is great. Great to be in the locker room. You know, she's the ultimate teammate. Now, Ranji is looking forward to her next step, playing for the University of Minnesota, where she was recruited and then committed. For one, it was the academic side. Um, it's like ring number two in the country for pre-med, so I wanted to be a plastic surgeon, so I knew I was going to have to go into the pre-med soon enough. So that was really one of my decisions. My second major decision was Coach Pam, which she's no longer there, but uh, she was really a key factor in me choosing that school. But um, I talked to the new coach, and. Um, I got a good feel for her, and I know she's going to be a great coach, just like Coach Pam. And um, I'm really looking forward to getting down there and working out in the summer and getting to know her better. Dad wasn't so sure in the beginning that Minnesota was the right place for Ranji. Flew out to you know Minnesota, and uh, man, my whole trip down there, I was saying, man, there's no way, there's no way that these these this college is going to get my kid, man. I, I, man. There's no way I'll send her up here this far. And she smiled the whole time. And I kept looking at her saying, man, why are you smiling? Like, man, there's no way I'm going to leave you up here. Why are you smiling? But I couldn't take the smile off her face, man. And uh, that's where it all began, you know. Although her time at Manville is almost at an end, Randy has many fond memories that will stay with her. 
Taylor and Yimmy is winning the state title, of course. I'm um, definitely going to miss the people that I was around as far as my friends and everybody. And uh, just walking the hallways and just feeling loved by the community and the teachers. They really show much respect to the team this year. I'm Cynthia Nickerson. Thanks for watching Comcast High School Sports on Demand, powered by MaxPreps.com.